Hi guys and girls and thank you for joining us here at Black Stag Styling for another one of our videos. Um, if you haven't checked out our channel before please do get on the channel check out some of our other videos loads and loads of uh, bits and pieces on there from styling repairs hydro dipping you name it trucks cars vans motorbikes loads of things so please do check out some of the other videos but the reason you're joining us today is for the work we're doing on this lovely um, uh, Tesla Model 3 dual motor in like a cherry red um, this is for a youtuber so we're going to put the link down below for his channel please do check out his channel like and subscribe um he's doing uh, he, he's a lot further forwards than ourselves i think it's 814 uh, odd subscribers uh, 814,000 sorry subscribers so heading for a million so um get onto his channel it's captain excellent um if you are into your gaming well worth checking out the channel so do have a little look at that um, and uh, check out some of his videos as well so but we're doing his uh, Tesla forum we're doing all the maxed and design parts in the gloss black so it's a full kit to this um, so starting at the front we are going to be doing a uh, front splitter section uh, so bumper will be off that'll be all installed then moving down the sides of the car we have some uh, gloss black uh, side skirts then to the back of the vehicle, be rear bumper off, we have a rear diffuser and some uh, uh, side bumper extensions as well. So they're all be going on, then bumper back on the car. We have a gloss black uh, spoiler as well to go on the boot lid. And just to finish off the look, we have some awesome 19 inch gloss black Riviera alloy wheels with tires or new tires. So we're supplying and fitting all of this because we're a Maxton dealer. So please do give us a shout here at Black Stag Styling if we can help you with anything like this. Of course, don't forget to do like and subscribe to the channel. Um, then you can stay fully up to date with everything we're doing hopefully um you know comment on some of the videos like what we're doing it's a big help to us um and um you know it takes a lot of work doing our videos so please do um do help us on that side of things right so no more messing about let's get this vehicle um into the workshop before we start any of the work um adam's going to go through all the parts just show you everything before we start stripping the car and getting it all fitted so let's roll the intros and get cracking here we go We are fitting. So we've Superb got the uh, 19 inch Riviera wheels. Nice looking wheel. Gonna look good on there. They're then, a very smart wheel. They're gonna go nicely yep. with the car, aren't they? Look lovely, wouldn't they? And then we have all the Maxton bits we're fitting. So we've got the rear diffuser, the front splitter, uh, rear spoiler, boot spoiler. Let's have a look. So rear diffuser. Still got all the protective tape and everything on, aren't they, at the yeah. moment? Till we're fitted, we'll leave that on. Uh, then we've got the two side skirts. So splitter, sorry, then two side skirts. Da -da -da. And then we have these small little rear corner pieces to go on. Rear extensions, I believe they're called. That's it, and they're the bits off the yeah, rear bumper corners. Superb. But yeah, we'll crack on, get them all, all on. Lovely jubbly. Mm. So the guys have now got the car onto the ramp and have put all the uh, warning uh, signs up for and everything for the electric vehicles and are now taking the front bumper off. Here they go, look. One they got their trestle all ready and raring to go. Woohoo! Make sure everything's all protected. And then let's like, say the reason we uh, take the bumpers off 
is to make sure that we don't, when we're fitting all these parts, because we're using uh, metal fixings, we don't want to drill through anything and damage anything. Also, we can line it all up correctly. So there you go, there's the uh, front of a Tesla, Model 3 with no bumper on. All that, all them electrics, look. What was the uh, oil level was all right, was it? Oh, yeah. yeah, all good. <laughs> on the level. On the level. Yeah, so Ad, Ad, I don't know if you could hear that. So Ad's just given it a clean um, because we'll be using a bonding agent as well as the metal fixings. Make sure it's all on there properly. Lovely times. Lovely times. Here we go, mate. Just getting a bit of a power adhesive onto the front uh, splitter of the Tesla. Um, I've done with a primer on there first and then power adhesive, but then it will also be bolted on. So it's definitely not going to come off. Well done, pal, well done. Definitely not. Already aligned it all, mate. Check the old fitment. I've lined it up and I have already drilled two holes just so I know I'm getting it banned on the right place. Then once we're on, I'll drill the rest of the holes. And get it on. Lovely jubbly. Lovely old job, Yo, hey? Maxton stuff's always good, and it, mate? Always fits, oh, mate, yeah, fits yeah. pretty well, doesn't need too much adjustment. Banner on fit, and it? Always a banner on fit. <laughs> Lovely. Maxton dealer, aren't we? Yeah, you know it, pal. You oh, know it. Well, Maxton needs. We want to see a few more electric and hybrid cars as well. Yeah. So if you're watching this and you've got your Tesla, your Lexus, whatever it might be, electric, fully electric or hybrid, give us a shout. Let's see if we can add some extra style because let's face it, they are a little bit, some of them are a little bit bland. A little bit, <laughs> a little bit bland. Not a little bland. bit lacking in the, the extra styling. So yeah, give us a... Give us a shout at Black Stag Styling. Let's add that Black Stag touch. Yeah, watch till the end. See what this one looks like. Yeah, baby. Yeah, don't miss it. Don't, don't miss it. Don't flick to Not another channel. Again, so don't miss it. See if you slip that bottom bit just in, inside here. Right, here we go, guys. Yeah, we'll now getting it uh, onto the bumper. Try not to put any cedar everywhere. Like I say, by doing it this way, we can make sure everything, everything fits correctly. So, uh, like I say, Ad, or like Ad was saying, he's got his first bolt holes drilled and the bonding agent on. He'd also put a primer coat on as well, just to make sure it bonds fully to the uh, to the bumper. Get the first two bolts on and done up, and then uh, any other holes, which will be along that front section, be able to get them drilled as well. Yeah, the holes are golden, it, Rob. Right, here we go. We're now going to get the bumper and back onto the Tesla. Uh, we're all bolted on now. Got a lovely load of bolts and screws through the bottom, plus our bonder to hold it all on lovely and tight. Superb. Superb. Have you got your attractive helper? Give me attractive helper. He's Italian. busy, so I've got Rob. That's Italian Rob. <laughs> the Roberto. Italian the Roberto. Roberto, watch your step, Robert. Are you okay there, sweet cheeks? Yeah. That's it. We have to have the chain up because the, the fact it's an electric car, then we all go, <laughs> <laughs> then we all trip over it. You okay, Robert? Put the parts right, so on. Let me get my plug in then. Hold it there for a sec. There we go. Get the old bumper back on the car. Put its new Maxton design lower section. Da -da -da. You look at my button. I was, mate. You In fact, were. the whole audience were. I thought you were. Now, now they are. Now you've mentioned it. Got well, some views now. What up, boys? Rob, Rob's got his Maxton Design stickers on his back. <laughs> <Don't know> about <laughs> them. <laughs> you happy there, Robert? Yeah, I'm happy. Lovely job. Get some bolts in. Get some screws in. Job of being done. Excellent job. Right, here we go. Ad's now getting the uh, rear diffuser all on. Yeah. Uh, to be honest, he's got ahead of the game here. They've already test fitted it. Yeah. Lined it all up, done some marks, little uh, yellow marks, just to make sure it's all in the right place on the back bumper when it goes back on. And then Ad has put his primer onto this and then the sealer, look, or bonding agent. Look at that, some lovely little lines, mate. Got lovely lines, no Lovely lines. Right, you ready, Rob? Now, time to get it on. Get it on. I've still got all this protective film on, so. 
Uh, also, Rob has uh, already started getting the wheels on, hasn't he, mate? So, uh, original wheels are all off, two of them there, and two of them there. Front diffuser all on. We'll come round, just show you one of the wheels. So here we go, and we've got one of the wheels on. They're going to look really smart, going to go nicely with all the gloss black parts. Rear wheels are not fitted yet because uh, the guys are just getting all the back or rear bumper sections on. Just lining it all up. And then Ed will just, yeah, just get his first couple of bolts in just to keep it in position. Then he can pull his uh, tape tape off, ready to get the tape in place. Already the bonding agent's on there, so uh, yeah. And then start to uh, get the uh, final screws in for the back rear section. Right, here we go. They're going to, um, the guys are just test fitting the uh, little corner sections. Dad's already lined it all up and uh, put down his markings. So they're nice little corner bits that just add onto the edges of the bumper. Work perfectly with the rear diffuser, which is of course now on the car. Uh, and these will be bolted and bonded on, of course, as well. And then in a moment, Roberto is going to get the other wheel on, isn't he, bud? Yeah. There she is, look. Right, we're uh, now over with uh, Italian Roberto, getting the la last wheel onto the car. So we've also got black bolts as well to put these on. Uh, just to go with the wheel, just so it uh, obviously you don't want, we don't really want silver bolts in the middle, it's going to look a little bit rubbish. So we've got black bolts just to finish it all off. Do look smart, this is just adding that finishing touch to the car. We have got the front one already on, so we'll pan round. There we go, look. Looking very smart. Oh, hello. <laughs> yeah, there we go, look. Really smart. Going with all the gloss black parts on the car, so yeah, moving along nicely with this now. The next bit will be the side skirts, and then we'll have the rear um, spoiler for the boot lid as well. Tesla here. We're going with a little bit of Bonda as well and then it has some nice double-sided 3M sticky tape. Superb. We, we've already done a little test fit, we've held it on the back, we've also marked it on the uh, front so we know exactly where we're sticking it. Superb, you got your little cutouts, is that where you put them? Got a little uh, cutout here, let's start putting it in. Hey, let's show you, let's not mess about. Any little dob in each little bit, all that need. Right, like Rob. Yep. Mr. Whitney style. A little dob rob. Little dob rob. I know dob. Whoa. If you move it again like that, you will be, mate. <laughs> and uh, like Ad said, uh, we've, it's got the 3M tape on it, but the, the bond just, it just means it's not going to go anywhere. But, you know, it's not going to, it's not, there's no risk of it coming off, is it, mate? Nah. Take that risk nah, away. That's it. I'm not really into bondage, but in these cases, but bonding, it's, a, it's a need must. But you know? Bonding, <laughs> not bondage. <laughs> and, and don't you lie to me, pal. I know you're into, you're into anything. <laughs> right, come on, keep up. Come on. No, I'm lagging behind you. I don't you, nearly, over the... you nearly missed it. <laughs> yeah, watch, you don't trip over the health and safety <laughs> precautions. I know. Right, on those markings, Rob. Don't let me there down, right? See the markings Ad's talking about? Look at that, look. Line it all up properly. Make sure it lines up eight a reet. Oh. Is that your biscuits? I have custard on his biscuits. I'd be more upset if they were my biscuits. Yeah, that is true. He would be. He'd be devastated. Good press down. 
and we do that thing when you get a new phone, yeah, where you take the skin off the front. But, uh. Lovely jubbly. <laughs> Rob got the tape off. No messing around there. There we go, it's got its little Maxton badge in the middle of all the parts. Da -da -da. Looking good, looking good, gentlemen. Looking good. As always. Spoiler alert. The fuse is all on, look. <laughs> With the little side Spoiler sections alert. as well. Next thing, side skirts, isn't it? Yeah, yeah baby, last thing, side skirts. Last thing. Ah, Alexander. <laughs> How the devil are you? I'm uh, all primed and ready to go. Oh, mate. <laughs> Lovely old job. We're now going on, pal, really. We've uh, test fitted it. You missed out on a little bit. We've test fitted it. We've stretched it up. We've pre-drilled all the holes. Oh, mate, you're on it. Mate, we're right on it. Put you, primer on. Get the seed Rob on. Rob have been on it, any Rob? I've been on it. You've been on it, have you, mate? <laughs> <laughs> the toilet we talked about now, are we? <laughs> Ten minutes in there, <laughs> waiting for him. <laughs> Lovely, got some primer on. Yeah, baby. Ready and raring for some bonding agent. Superb. It's the last bits, isn't it, mate? Two size cuts, last bits. Yeah. She's looking good. We're getting there, aren't uh, we? Can look cool, isn't it? Yeah. We've had to jack her up a little bit just so we can get under there nicely. Yeah. Give ourselves plenty of room. Yeah, man. Rob has been underneath the car degreasing it and all sorts, isn't he, Rob? Yeah, a lo lo lovely time he had. He's had you doing all the work, has he, Rob? Absolutely yeah. lovely. Using the asteroid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's a boy, isn't he? He's a boy. He's a boy. Right, let's right. give that a couple more seconds to dry. We'll get some seed on. Superb. Right, time to get that bonding agent on. Let's get it on. We use the uh, Terrason one here, so that's rather yeah, good, baby. that stuff. There we go, let an add will follow his line of primer. It's just like icing a cake, isn't it? <laughs> oh, no. well, Can you never, ice a cake? I've never iced a cake, but oh. so I'm told. Probably like it though. Yeah. Right, and there'll be time to get this onto the vehicle. Yes. Right, here we go. Guys are going to get it all on. It's obviously already been all lined up and marked. Alan's got his marks. You can see him down there, look. That's Rob. That's not Mark. That's Roberto. That's Rob. Ah, Roberto. That's cool, isn't it? Right, do you want to move and sit slightly more in the middle, Roberto? And hold the whole thing. Rob's got his special Maxton design stickers on. I said, I've, I've actually got the new Maxton design clothing. <laughs> Very yeah. nice. Trolling alongside with our black alongside, staff. Alongside your black staff. Good, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, Very boy. Fun. Yeah, he got a few on. Wicked and Chris. He even got them in here. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know that yet, though. I do. <laughs> right, so once, they make, once they're happy with it all lined up with the marks, then um, I think we've got the um, bolts and screws, bits and pieces just to go in to fix it, and then the bonding agent will set as well. Easy as that. It's easy as that, he says, holding the camera. It's quite a heavy camera, you know. It, yeah, it is heavy camera.
there we go people we have finished another tesla model 3 dual motor in for some awesome styling here at black stag styling uh, like we always say do give us a, a shout and check us out on all of our socials loads of links down below uh, to see all the things we get up to and of course stay tuned for more videos but um, for the for this week we've had like I say the Tesla Model 3 in um, we've done quite a few bits and pieces to this um, it's been a real pleasure because uh, the other video was spotted on YouTube by uh, this gentleman who is a YouTuber um, so if you're into your gaming please do check him out we could put the link down below in uh, in the in the links so you can have a look at his channel on here and that's if you're into your gaming please do check him out uh, that is Captain Excellent, uh, big channel, check him out, like and subscribe of course if you're into all your gaming. Um, but on his Tesla, like I say, found us through YouTube, on his Tesla we have been doing all the Maxton design styling parts um, and some new alloy wheels. So starting at the front of the car we have the, uh, we've had the front bumper off and then we've supplied and installed the Maxton design gloss black front splitter section. Uh, so that's all of course glued, bonded, as you've seen in the video, onto the vehicle. Then moving down the sides of the vehicle, we have the gloss black side skirts. A couple of different options for these. These are the ones we've gone with. Uh, look really smart and of course flow nicely with that front splitter. Um, moving to the back bumper. Uh, on the rear of the car we have uh, the rear diffuser section again in the gloss black so that's been uh, fitted and bonded um, onto the vehicle of course lined up as well we've got some little side sections of course that go on as well they just flow around with the rear diffuser uh, look really smart so they're all on and then of course the uh, rear spoiler onto the boot lid all bits like I say in gloss black you can't beat the gloss black with the red just looks awesome and then of course to finish everything off we have the 19 inch a Riviera gloss black alloy wheels with new tires um, and hopefully you'll agree it completely changes the look of the Tesla into really what now is a, a proper sports looking car so the Tesla's as um, as they wanted to uh, keep them all looking the same so it keeps the brand all noticeable when it's out but hey come and see us get some proper styling done to them we can make it look a lot more awesome and just stand out from all the others out there so give us a shout black stag styling do like and subscribe to the channel please do turn on the notifications and stay fully up to date with everything we're doing um, and uh, we'll give you the last look around the car to finish of course as well and then hopefully we'll catch you in the very near future for some more videos stay tuned take care see you soon thanks very much